On Friday against the Bucks, the Lakers were down one with a chance to win the game when the camera panned to D'Angelo Russell giving his teammates some instructions before he hit the game-winning shot. For some context, LeBron James was out because of an ankle injury, which meant that D'Lo was given command of the offense. He had taken on the challenge as he was scoring all night, specifically by attacking Brooke Lopez in the pick and roll. With the Lakers down four, Russell runs a ball screen with Lopez dropping, and he's able to finish the floater along with a foul to pull LA within two. After Russell hits the free throw, the Bucks come out wanting Damian Lillard to isolate Anthony Davis. Lillard drives to his left and gets a decent look at a floater, but he just misses and the Lakers corral the rebound, which leads us to the moment you're waiting for. Now, because I had to stitch the interaction from the ESPN feed and the Lakers feed together, it's hard to exactly follow the sequence of events, but here's how it appears to go down. LeBron wanted Russell to take the last shot, and Russell's explained to him the play, and he says I so he approves of the plan. Then Russell tells Dinwiddie, so hey, screen first, then roll, before the camera cuts. In the huddle, Darvin Hamden looks up at Russell and says, hey, what we got? Then Russell explains that he wants to run the pick and roll with Dinwiddie as a screener to get a mismatch. But there's another part to this that the camera didn't pick up in the huddle. Out of the timeout, Anthony Davis looks back and he says, pick and roll, pick and roll, before pointing at the player to go inbound the ball, and it turns out to be Rui Achimura. So putting this together, it appears that Russell wants Dinwiddie to screen for him to get a mismatch, and then he's going to run another pick and roll with Rui Achimura to set up the game winner. And that's exactly what happens. Dinwiddie first screens so that Russell could get Lillard as his matchup, then because Achimura has broke Lopez on him, he sets the second screen. But because Lopez doesn't want to switch, he backs up, and Russell is then able to get past Lillard into space, and he hits the floater to give the Lakers a one-point lead. But that's not all. Before the Bucks inbound the ball, Russell is yelling at Dinwiddie at the sideline to take Dame. You can see him continuing to point at Dame because he knows that he's getting the ball, so he wants Dinwiddie to be ready. As Dame runs up, Russell points at Dinwiddie to match up with him, and this ends up paying off as he gets a game-saving block to get the Lakers a much-needed win to stay in their coveted ninth place in the standings. So yes, not only did Russell score 44 points to give the Lakers a much-needed offensive boost, he also drew up at least part of the game-winning shot and gave Dinwiddie some fantastic defensive instruction to help LA close the game. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If so, please feel free to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.